Hey guys, Edward here with Power Mechanical. So spring is right around the corner, but one thing we've learned in this business is boiler season never ends. So we're heading it back over to the valve shop this morning where they got a special valve they're working on we want to check out. So we're back in the valve shop this morning. I'm here with my man John Jennings. They got a really unique valve I want to show you guys. Good morning, Amber. Hey man. It's a, a multi-port uh, drain valve is what they call it, but it's actually a, a type of relief valve. And we haven't had any luck getting parts on them, so we're having to make a lot of the stuff for it to get, try to get the customer back up online. And we've, you know, done machine work, machine the seats, and we're lapping the other seats. And uh, it's pretty much like a, sort of like a relief valve. Uh, keeps the relief, kind of protects the relief valve from lifting all the time. When the pressure comes up, these will start opening and slowly relieve the pressure instead of popping the relief valve and dump it back to, to, to the system. And, uh, they're they're down right now, so we're we're working what we're doing. What we can do to get it tested for. Them. So it's almost like they're it's partitioned to where it can relieve a little bit at a time. Is right. kind of what. Right. Okay, I see. Instead of like a relief valve, just opens up all the way. This just this will just open up just enough to drop the pressure down, so the relief valve won't lift or whatever you have it set at. Gotcha. Now the I know these guys they use a spring to actuate the. Or is this a spring actuated like a single spring or is it got individual springs on each port? It's got individual springs that operate on one plate so they will they will just like fluctuate with pressure. You okay. Know? They'll, they'll, they won't yep. open up just all of a sudden relieve it. Yeah so it can it, it can actually kind of probably teeter. It's kind of like a regulator almost. Gotcha. Okay. Well cool that's uh I'm really anxious to see this one go back together so we're going to come back in a couple of days and see them when they put this on the test stand. Y'all stick around so you can check that out. So after we cut, I told John he should have done his like Scarface impression while he did this. And it's kind of funny because he actually has one. <laughs> and you people need people like me. <laughs> you know why? You don't have the guts to be what you want to be. You need people like me. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that. It's always great going over to the machine shop because they're always working on something really interesting. And I want you to stick around for our channel for more videos and we'll see you next week.